So everybody, this is me reacting to the quotes that Eric Ten Hag has said in his pre-season press conference. We're going to be talking about next season's aims, things that are going on at Manchester United, talking about new philosophies, as well as much, much more. We'll be talking about the new changes that have been made to Old Trafford and Manchester United. But without further ado, let's get straight into it. So, as I said in the last video, I start, I'm going to start off every video with a question now. And the question of this video is... Do you think Eric Ten Hag will win a trophy in the 2024-25 season for Manchester United? Have your thoughts in the comments um, and give me your opinions as well. Do you think he can and do you think he will win a trophy? But let's get straight into it as well. So, Eric Ten Hag said a few interesting things. He started off by saying, with the new ownership coming in, they can help us. They've been very supportive and we can make our process. The last day of the season, the FA Cup final win, it was a brilliant day. One of the best days for many people. We showed we can compete with the best and beat them. We have to set the standards and control the standards every day. So listen, Eric Ten Hag has immediately said that we know we can do better than what we have done. But even in our poorest season, we kind of have gone with the best teams. And we are kind of competing with them. And that's something that obviously is facts. I mean, listen, regardless of what you can say about Manchester United season, it was a poor season last season. But we kind of worked on it, we worked hard, and we and we come out with a trophy. And that's, many clubs didn't do that. So, as at the end of the day, football is about winning trophies. And that's something that Manchester United did. So, I'm really, really happy with that. Obviously, the FA Cup was a great day. Um, FA Cup final, I remember watching it. What a fantastic game it was. Absolutely outclassed Manchester City. It was such a great time for Manchester United. And we did so, so well in that game. Now, the next season's aim, um, listen, a lot. We win an FA Cup and a Carabao Cup, but we have high expectations and we have to raise our standards. When we go into every game with those standards, we have a very, very good chance of being very, very successful. So listen, next season's going to be a big season for Den Haag. Obviously, he got a contract extension now, which will keep him at the club until 2026. We know that. He's got a lot to do in this next season. He's got to kind of solidify everything that he's got to be we got to be increasing our position in the table, finishing higher than we possibly can. Um, top three, maybe, if we can. Um, and we've got to kind of progress. We've got to be going far in the FA Cup, making it to the final like we did last season and the season before. Hopefully winning the Carabao Cup Europa League. We've got to make sure we can get into that as well. We have to make sure that we're, we could do everything we can. Listen, last season was really, really poor with all the injuries that we got. And it didn't really go in our favour. This season, we're going to have players coming in. A new kind of rejuvenated staff with Eric Ten Hag. New coaches coming in as well. It's going to be a season to learn things. But it's also going to be a season where we can actually progress a lot. Um, and that's something Eric Ten Hag is going to have to do massively and very, very importantly. So, yeah, let's see what we can do. Can we win a trophy? I do so anything we have got in us. I mean, four big competitions um, that we're competing in. Europa League, FA Cup, Premier League. And um, the Carabao Cup, there certainly is a trophy out there that Manchester United can go on and win. What that trophy may be, we can may maybe even win two. So let's see what we can do. Um, and yeah, let's see what happens. With a trophy, um, Eric Ten Hag said, we're working on this. As I said, Manchester United didn't win a trophy for six years. Now we've won two. We're aiming higher, like the Premier League title. I know with the setup in the club and the changes in the structure, we will be ready for the future. We feel it. So listen, Eric Ten Hag has kind of made a big claim there. I don't think we certainly won't be challenging for the Premier League next season. Um, that's almost impossible, I believe, with the clubs that are in the Premier League. It's going to be very, very difficult to do so. Manchester United have found it very, very difficult to challenge. I um, just don't think we have the squad or the players yet. But as I said, with the, with the setup that Manchester United are building, the changes in the structure, he can see a lot of positive things coming. And listen, we, we can only see the outside picture the positive change that is in getting in new recruiters. But Ten Hag can see it day in, day out, what's happening. And the fact that he said um, we'll be ready for the future and he's happy with the changes, we can certainly be successful. That is kind of pleasing to hear as well. So I'm really, really happy with that. I think Eric Ten Hag is a very, very sound manager. He knows what he's talking about. And Manchester United have got a great manager on their hands. So really, really happy with this. See what we can do. See what Manchester United can do. Hopefully we can get a trophy. Now, he also said with the new football instruction, we are so pleased around the football, around the first team. We have a strong structure that will help us. They are so supportive. They will help us in scouting, recruitment, and they will raise the bar. So that's obviously him talking about um, Jason Wilcox, Dan Ashworth, 
and all the kind of new recruitments um coming into Manchester United. That that is really nice to see. I think the overall um consensus of the interview that Eric Ten Hag gave was a lot was really, really positive. I think he showed a lot, he answered a lot, um and he kinda of gave a lot into the insight of Manchester United. I've only took kind of the best bits that went on in that interview, but he did do a very, very good job in kind of articulating himself very, very well. And he gave us some positivity to look forward to going into the next season. So really, really happy with that. See hopefully what Eric Ten Hag can build. See what can do. Now he said in football, the next game is the most important game. The season, the next season is the most important. He said in the training ground of the atmosphere, there's no way not to be positive about it. So it's looking good for the future. Hopefully we can succeed and get a lot um, a lot of positivity around the club. But let me know your thoughts. This has been me reacting to Eric Ten Hag's pre-season interview. As I said, we'll be keeping up to date with all the Manchester United news. Drop a like, comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching and peace.